time to get her sideways. Yo, what's up, guys? This is Gold Dust Customs here. Um, I'm going to walk through this video while I finish building this rocket. So, this first clip I'm showing you right now, this is um, tubes that I get from my work. And I had this great idea. I went up to Matt and said, Matt, why don't we just build our own rockets instead of going to Hobby Lobby and buying them? And then we're like, well, let's give it a shot. All right, guys, just got this thing spray painted white. Got it all taped up. I'm about to spray paint it red. I'm going to use some um, Rust Oleum gloss red spray paint and we're gonna make like a candy cane print probably gonna call it the candy paint rocket so yeah i'll get back to you when i get it spray painted all right everybody i just finished painting it red it came out actually looking pretty good i like that glossy red uh, i'm gonna let it dry overnight and then tomorrow we'll take that tape off and see how that um candy cane print came out so yeah i'll pick y'all up tomorrow all right guys so we just finished this up just got the tape taken off of it it actually turned out looking pretty good. I love how the pattern came out. Um, yeah, now we just gotta go 3D print the cone and the wings. Got the cone and the wings, spray painted white, wait for it to dry, put a scent coat on them, and then. Oh yeah, as you've seen this video that I'm showing right now, so we wanted to see what an E12 motor could do, which is the biggest motor you can buy from Hobby Lobby. So I just took one of the tubes, and we just made a, just a really janky rocket out of it. And we're just gonna see how high it would actually send it. So yeah, that's why I built this. It's just a prototype. So I'll let the video show it. Prototype, launch number two. Ready in three, two, one. Watch you. There she is, in the tree. Good launch. All right, guys. As y'all just saw, we got done launching that uh, prototype one. And as you can tell, it's about half size of the candy cane rocket that we're building. So, we had one E12 in that half one, in the prototype one, I should say. And it's in about probably 500, 600 feet. So our solution for that is, well, four E12s. Yep, four of them. So we're going to uh, design this where there will be four separate holes for all these motors to fit into. And then we'll rig them all up where they all go off at one time. So instead of one E12 for this bad boy, we're gonna have four of them. So. All right guys, so we just got this thing rigged up. Uh, yeah, so instead of um, the igniters, we just use fuses from mortars actually. <laughs> So, yep, we got it all fused up, ready to go. Got a straw on as our guide. All right, everybody. So, here we got the uh, rocket all set up. Got the lighter. Got the fuse. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Oh, I suck. Oh! Isn't that nice? <laughs> Shot a motor out. It's good! That's in good shape. <laughs> yeah, so you see in that attempt, we try to make the wings out of uh, cardboard from a shoebox. And it did not work out at all. The rocket just spiraled out of control. Um, yeah, so then we had a better idea. We said, okay, we thought... I mean, we knew the wings were probably not good for it, that we made for it, but we also thought it was just too much power for just the two tubes itself. So that's when we decided to make it a little bit bigger. So we added two more tubes to it. And I'm about to show you the clip of how that one went. Three, two, one. E minus. Uh -uh. 
And as you see, it almost took out Aiden. <laughs> so um, we learned from that that um, always use a guide rod. We did not have a guide rod at that one, which was dumb of us. You know, we just wanted to try it anyways. But we're like, okay, four twos, maybe a little too much. So then we said, okay, two's too little, four's too much. What about three tubes? And so you can see, we're going to use three tubes now. And I'll show you how that one went. Yeah, you can see, you see those things flying in there? Yeah, those are the motors. So yeah, we didn't hot glue the motors into the rocket pod. Because, I mean, the past ones, they didn't matter. They didn't fly out. But this one, I guess they decided not to stay in the pod anymore. And they flew right out the top. I actually caught the field on fire. I like, get no footage because we're trying to put it out. But you just saw here running around like a wild man trying to put out a fire in a field. But we finally got it out. Nobody was hurt. Only a couple... Only a couple spots of grass was burnt, and the horse was a little, little scared. But other than that, everything was well. So you know, after that, I was ready to basically give up because, like, man, like I'm done spending money on these motors because it's like twenty-seven dollars a shot for four motors. I'm like, I'm done, done doing this. I don't want to do it no more. Then a couple weeks ago, I was like, well, you know what? I got three brand new tubes. But you know what? I'm going to give it one more shot, and we're going to do it right this time. So I went to Hobby Lobby, and we picked up, I don't know what this material is, but it's like really, really thick stuff, like board. And so we're like, we're going to make the fins out of that, secure it, make sure it is perfectly good this time. So no mess ups. And that's what we did. And, um... Yeah, so we did that, and you can see, I started building it back together, and I'll show you the video, a little sneak peek I put on the, the TikTok about it, in the short. You think I'm psycho, don't you, Mom? Mama poured me a cup. So yeah, there's a little funny video I made about it, just a sneak peek about our next video is coming out, which is this one. So, then yeah, you can see we got it back together. And then I'm going to show you how that one launch went. I will. Three, two, one. Yeah! <laughs> Come on, parachute. Pop, pop, where's the parachute? Oh, no. Oh, man. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, <laughs> Alright guys, hope y'all enjoyed. As you can see, the rocket got in the air that time. And it took us four tries over a span of three months. But we got it. We never gave up. Even though I wanted to, I never did. Kept going. That's just like anything in life. Just never give up on your hopes and dreams. Just keep them going. I know ours is just a rocket, but this is our dream. We want to make entertaining videos for y'all guys. So yeah, um, if y'all have any suggestions for what we should do next, well, we have a couple pretty cool ideas coming up. Um, there will be some sneak peeks of shorts and stuff about it. But other than that, I'll see y'all guys later. Have a good one. Peace.